Hello friends, I am Dr. Samir Sawan. Today we will discuss test for pyrogen by rabbit method. So what are pyrogens? Pyrogens are fewer inducing organic substances, metabolic products of microorganism, which are responsible for many febrile reactions. In pharmaceutical industry, pyrogen testing should be done to every batch of pharmaceutical product, particularly parental product. Best animal model for pyrogen testing is the rabbit model. Why rabbit is the best model? Because rabbits generate reproducible results that are similar to the tissue responses to human. And this rabbit method is economic also. So what are the requirements for this experiment? Animals. Healthy mature rabbits of either sex. Instruments, pyrogen free syringes, needles, glassware, clinical thermometer and probes. Then reagents, 0.9% sodium chloride injection as a diluent. Now what is the procedure? Select healthy mature rabbit of either sex for the study. House them individually in place that is free from disturbance. Then maintain these animal at the room temperature 20 to 23 degrees centigrade. Make all the material and equipment pyrogen free. For the making this material pyrogen free, we need to heat the same at 250 degrees centigrade for not less than 30 minutes. Then standardized clinical thermometer with the precision of 0.1 degree centigrade. It is used to measure the rectal temperature of the rabbit. So, test them to determine that maximum reading is attaining in less than 5 minutes or not. Now, preliminary test that is also called as a sham test. So, to conduct the sham test, animals using for the first time in the pyrogen testing or have not been used during the two previous weeks on which we need to conduct the sham test. Hence, in this sham test, we need to acclimatize this animal for one to three days before using the pyrogen testing of the sample. Then, select the three rabbits and fast the rabbits overnight with the free access to the water and withhold the water during the test also. Then inject the sterile pyrogen free saline solution intravenously at the dose of 10 ml per kg of body weight. Then record the temperature with the thermometer of uh, thermometer uh, uh, of this animal 90 minutes prior to the injection and continue for 3 hours at the interval of half an hour after the injection. Now exclude those animals showing temperature variation of 0.6 or more for main test. Now this is marginal vein of ear of rabbit. Uh, and this is the thermometer by which we can record the rectal temperature of rabbit. Nowadays, advanced thermometer, digital thermometer can be used to recording the temperature of the rabbit. Now, main test. So, select the three rabbits that pass the sham test for the main test. Then, determine the initial body temperature of this rabbit and it should be between 38 to 39.8 degrees centigrade. Afterward, dilute the solution to test with pyrogen free saline solution or any solution that is what given in an official monograph. Then warm the test liquid to 38.5 degree centigrade before injection. Then inject the solution to the animal slowly into the marginal vein of the air for a period of not more than 4 minutes and the volume injected should not less than 0.5 ml per kg and not more than 10 ml per kg of body mass. Then 
determine the temperature of each animal at every half an hour for three hours after injection. Now this is the observation table. So in table one, recording of initial and final body temperature in column one here uh, number of rabbits first second third is there then in this second column initial body temperature recorded and in this column uh, final body temperature half hourly can be recorded and put into this observation table now how to interpret the result so uh, first uh, remember that consider any decrease in final body temperature as raise in zero then consider the test solution as a pyrogen free or consider uh, the test solution pass the test when individual rabbit showing a temperature less than 0 0.6 degree centigrade and sum of the response of three rabbit does not exceed 1.4 degree centigrade. Consider the test fail when the temperature exceed than the above limit. When test fail, additional 5 rabbits taken and continue the test using these 5 other rabbits. So, afterward, test is passed and consider that it is a pyrogen free when not more than 3 rabbits out of 8 shows individual rise in body temperature of 0 0.6 degree centigrade or the sum of the responses of the groups of 8 rabbit does not exceed 3.7 degree centigrade. Here, this is the conclusion. Differences in initial and final body temperature of rabbit individually or in group determine presence or absence of pyrogen in test substances. Now, we will complete this practical with the help of software. For this purpose, we use